large, sweet, delicious, spiny lobsters and Bahamas. Most people does not know that these two things go hand in hand. People only associate Bahamas with cruises, beaches and snorkeling. That's not always true. Come on, let's go catch and eat some fresh lobsters, conch and other fish. Join us please. Hello, my name is Solomon and this is Gina. We love to travel to exotic places and cultures to enjoy the local cuisines, natural wonders and entertainment. We are known as the spicy travelers because we originally hail from the land of exotic spices or better known as India. We love to eat, cook and watch others prepare food with local exotic spices. On a cold, boring Wednesday evening, sitting around a fireplace in our backyard, we suddenly got craving for fresh lobsters. Now lobsters in South Florida can be expensive and they are not easy to catch. No idea. What about Bahamas? It's only three and a half hours away on a ferry from Florida. Or we could take the local cruise line to Bahamas. They were having a sale for $99 per person. So this way we can enjoy the cruise and get some lobsters as well. That Friday evening we hopped on the cruise. It was fun. It was a lot of food, games and music. Very next morning we arrived in Nassau, Bahamas. The island looked very much dead as it did not recover from the last hurricane. Everything looked destroyed or hardly any people. We took a local taxi to a fish town away from the tourist areas. So two fishermen bringing back tons of lobsters, conch and other seafood. We asked them if they can help us catch some lobsters. After good bargaining we got a good deal at a low price. In one hour we were on our way. We went with them and caught many large spiny lobsters and other seafood. After three hours of fishing we got back. They were nice enough to clean it for us and also cook it for us in many different ways. Well, see for yourself.